Hey everyone, Barbie here, back for another great DIY video, and this time I'm in Sydney, Australia with Madison de Rosario. Madison is a gold medalist and a world-renowned wheelchair racer. Morning, Madison. Hi, Barbie. Thank you for having me. So, what are we up to today? This morning, we are gonna make a smoothie, which is often my first meal of the day. I love smoothies. What are we putting in today's smoothie? Mostly berries and banana uh, with some Greek yogurt, honey, and chia seeds. <gasps> it sounds so good. <laughs> How do you make it? Step one is we're gonna get all of our fruit together. A combination of fruit is really important because each one gives you different kinds of vitamins and minerals. But it doesn't really matter what you put in it. As long as you're putting like healthy, fresh fruit in it, it's gonna be good. Awesome. Step two is washing the fruit and we wanna make sure our parents are home when we start to cut things. Oh, totally. So Madison, mm -hmm. When did you get into racing? I got into racing when I was 12. I started by playing wheelchair basketball and tennis, and I was terrible at them, but I kept playing them because they were a lot of fun. But when I found wheelchair racing, I just fell in love with it straight away. That's incredible. Put in as many or as little berries in the fruit as you want. It doesn't matter, it depends on how hungry you are. I love that so much. <laughs> or you can add more if you're making a batch for two people. You can freeze your bananas beforehand so that your smoothie is extra cold by the time it's ready. Definitely. I always do that. <laughs> now we are going to put in our yogurt. It's going to give us our protein. And the chia seeds give us a little bit of carbohydrates, which is where we get all our energy from. They don't look like much when they're in the bowl, but they expand a lot when they have liquid added to them. Interesting. So, what do you like to do when you're not racing or training? I love my dog so much. I think I spend every moment I'm at home with him. I look forward every day to getting to walk him. Um, yeah, no, I, I love him. Aww. Should we add anything else? Honey to make it a little bit sweet. Definitely honey. It's my favorite. And the last step we're gonna do is add some kind of liquid. So that we have coconut water here, but it can be milk or just plain water, it doesn't matter. And that's just to get it all to mix properly. Step three is blend it all together. And then we're ready to have our breakfast. One last question. What advice do you have for girls who are trying out a new sport or doing something new for the first time? I would tell anyone trying a new sport or doing something new that you already have absolutely everything you need to make that work. And it doesn't matter how good or bad you are at it, as long as you love what you're doing, then it's for you. What a cool message. I love that. And the smoothie is delicious. Thank you so much for having me over. Thanks for coming over, Bobby. This is fun. So much fun. <laughs> I can't wait to watch you race and come back for another visit. If you try the smoothie recipe at home, let me know which fruits you use. And click around my channel for more DIYs. Taste.